just what we need. Let's get to work. Hey, what's going on, fellow Rangers? Welcome back to another video here on Power Rangers Legacy Wars. My name is Dr. Snow, and today we finally have it. Yes, it is time. It's time for Rescue Ready. Uh, before we begin that, let's just go over a couple of things really quickly here. Uh, we have a brand new corruption zone uh, that will be taking place very, very shortly. As we can see here is zone number 26, Green Ranger. So if we want to take a look at the Green Ranger, no, it's not Tommy. It's all right. It's not Tommy. <laughs> we got enough Tommies for now. Uh, but it is finally, this is actually kind of long overdue, to be honest. I would assume that this would have been like when they started first introducing like this corruption zone with all the costumes and stuff. But little to be known, Rita, movie Rita finally gets her costume. That is incredible. Um, I, me personally, I'm not like super, super hype, but you know what? It's pretty cool. I'm glad that she's finally got it because technically she was the green ranger in the movie so this kind of this kind of in a way finishes the whole you know 2017 power rangers movie theme uh the only other thing i could probably see them do is probably put like zordon into the game and he'll, he'll be like helmetless zordon and he'll be the red ranger but you know what i mean that's kind of pushing it but i think finally we can close the saga of 2017 movie so um, the other person they could probably put is maybe Goldar, but that could be a Zord, maybe, or a Goldar skin Zord. <laughs> like, that'd be pretty cool. But anyway, that's her second taunt. Um, it's okay. What's her first taunt? Yeah, um, it's all right. <laughs> it's all right. It's like, that's the best I can say. It's all right. So that's your, uh, corruption zone. Uh, for this coming week, because the corruption zone is uh, number 20, was it 25? I totally forgot how, how many we're in it now. Yeah, 25 is almost finishing. So uh, with that being said, we also have a brand new character out of premium as well. Let's scroll all the way down here and let's see if we can find her. There it is on juice bar. So Akira, uh, here is finally available out of premium. So that's pretty cool. Uh, she's definitely a very very good character for epic class. So I definitely do like that So that would be it. That will be that and so for the finale Let's jump straight into it because this is what you guys have been waiting for for the whole time We're gonna talk about the brand new ranger coming into the game Carter Grayson Lightspeed rescue man attacker legendary <laughs> Oh man, you know, we have a lot of attacker legendary classes. I was I was wondering if we we're gonna get a defender, but you know, we gotta end the year of 2021 with a legendary. We did get two epics back to back, so it was kind of due for legendary. I know people are like, why so many legendaries? Why so many epics? No rares, no commons, but to be honest, guys, it doesn't make money. <laughs> just just to be frank, anyways, there to make it money, it's a business. And rares and legendary, um, epics and legendaries are what makes the money. So especially legendaries. So with that being said, uh, let's take a look at his bio. Holy smoke. That's a lot to read. All right. <laughs> Carter Grayson is one of the best firefighters in the city who uh, chooses this career path after a firefighter saved his life as a child, who was later revealed to be Captain Mitchell. Over the years, Captain Mitchell kept an eye on Carter, chosen to be the leader of the Power Ranger Lightspeed Rescue. That's actually pretty interesting because I don't, I actually don't watch Life to Be Rescue. I never watched the season. Uh, who courageously led the Rangers against, oh man, Di Diabolico and Banshear, Banshear's force after Lightspeed Rescue. This band, his, uh, he resumed his role as a firefighter. Really? That's cool. I didn't know that. So I guess after the season finale, I guess he just became a regular firefighter. That's interesting. Um... Yeah, so, all right, let's take a look at uh, his uh, move sets here. So, we can already see, I think he's going to be absolutely ridiculously good because he has, his primaries are threes and his uh, middle slot is going to be fours, which is great. And he has a super, so he's already S tier without me even watching anything. <laughs> so, rescue combo. Uh, Carter performs a spectacular combo finishing with the energy blast punch. So, we, if you guys did not see my previous video, 
I'm pretty sure this is what this move was, or it could be this one. No. So yeah, so rescue combo is what we saw yesterday when Enways um did like a, a small teaser. So that's when we saw rescue combo. Then we have thermal blaster. With thermal blaster, Carter shoots a hot beam burning the opponent. Okay, so I guess we're gonna have burn dom burn damage, which is uh dot damage. So that's what we're gonna have. That's pretty cool. It's gonna be something like the way Dagron has uh for damage wise. Uh his for a special blaster V shot. Carter uses his rescue blaster and V Lance to shoot the enemy multiple times. That's gonna be pretty cool to see. So again, um this is a projectile. So I, I really don't care for projectiles in this game, but uh, this could be very interesting. So especially since this is a breaker, I, I prefer if we're going to be if, if if a character has a projectile move, I prefer it to be a breaker than a strike, honestly. Uh, with the V Lancer, Carter uh, performs an incredible combo launching enemy into the air with the last hits. OK, that's pretty cool. And then his super is going to be Carter attacks the enemy with a super punch upon impact. He uses his light speed rescue weapons to perform an amazing combo. So I wonder if he's going to be switching out of different weapons. Again, I have never seen the season. So I do not know how many weapons they have. But obviously Power Rangers always have infinite weapons in their disposal. And then we have his assist. A three cost assist. Rescue Bird. Carter enters the battle shooting the enemy with his Rescue Bird. I do not know what that is. Again, I haven't seen the season. So I'm assuming he's going to come out of a vehicle. Which, that would be actually probably the first ever a character coming out with a vehicle. So, that's actually pretty interesting. I cannot wait to see what that looks like. So, with that being said, guys, that is it for today's video. Uh, I, if, if there's any more information coming out for Carter, I'll definitely upload it. But definitely stay tuned for tomorrow is going to be the unboxing as well as a live stream. Uh, normally, these characters come out at 3 p.m. EST my time. I could be wrong or it might be 2 p.m. EST because of daylight saving. So I don't know which one is it, but I'm pretty sure it might be EST. But anyway, you guys will see a, a post on it on my channel. So definitely stay tuned. Make sure you have notifications on because we are going to go ahead and play with our brand new and final character for 2021. Carter Grayson from Power Rangers Lightspeed Rescue. So with that being said, guys, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to see what he does. I want to see how insane he's going to be. If not, hopefully, hopefully, please, please don't be too broken. Please do not be Ninja Tommy broken. <laughs> please just be good. <laughs> so with that being said, guys, let me know your feelings and, and comments down below. I'll see you guys tomorrow officially for our unboxing and our live stream again. Stay tuned, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. How the world I forgot about the taunts. So I'm adding this in the back end. I told I always forget this. Every time I forget the taunts. Okay, that's the classic rescue ready pose. I like it. Ooh, let's play that again. It has a crazy sound if I hear it. Alright. Rescue ready. Alright, we're putting this in the back. Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I always forget about the taunts. Always. I'll see you guys the next time. Peace.